Hello and welcome! I'm Mitz Piano, and you're watching The Legend of Legends, Skyward Legend. So, after completing too many errands in the sky, we are on our way to Lanayru Mining Facility at last. <laughs> Nice place. Yeah, it's dungeon time. This one might not be a temple, but it's still going to be important. Also, why the heck would they have torches here and not electric lights? Well, uh, nice place. Looks metal, looks sandy, looks a lot like what we've been through. Wait, what are these? Aranches. This larval monster is said to live for a thousand years, during which time it is continually growing. Though the larva is small in size, it's quite ferocious and often found in swarms beneath the sand. It tends to leap toward moving objects such as yourself. Okay, so do not time shift any of these is what I'm getting at. Well, I mean, they're here in the present, and all our time shifts so far have been to the past. I don't think there are future time shifts. My cat needs to chill. He does. Yes, he do. Okay, but... Oh, right, we actually have bombs. We can give the statues the offering that they so richly deserve and also die. Maybe I should have restocked on bombs before coming here. Eh, I'll be fine. Fine. Okay, I am still audible. The mic is still in range. And the cat currently perched on my lap, aggressively nibbling my neck, is not going to change that. Though I gotta say, Kenny, you make the motion controls a little difficult to use. Alright. But like... Oh hey, I see bombs up there. So already we're hook feeling stuff. Good to know. Also, die. This, uh, I'm blaming the cat for that one, because he's still here, being a, an adorable little cat. Yes, you are. You are adorable. Yes, you are. You are the most adorable kitty. Got it. I was thinking we'd need that on both sides, but no, the one on the other side is already knocked over. Okay. Saves me some trouble. Ugh. Right. Activate. Wait. It only took one switch. What's the other switch do then? Hold on. We have to investigate this. <laughs> Let's let stamina recharge. <sighs> oh well. Huh? <laughs> 
no, no, no. Oh, just barely. All right. Open. Oh, okay. Well, that got us a chance. Not dealing with you, not dealing with you, not dealing with you. worthwhile considering that we emptied our wallet before coming here. But it was worth it. Die, die. Die. There are a lot of those little things there. I, oh, more of you! Uh, uh. Oh no, I know your friends. Ooh, thank you for another red rupee. You're kind of fitting that we'd have skeleton enemies here. There. Random flailing will never let me down. Well, uh, okay, I guess I'm not going this way. Great free. Oh, oh, I have one of stuck on me. Ew. I didn't even notice somehow. Oh, bombs. Okay, so, like, what am I trying to do here? I cannot move this because there's too much sand in the way. But I can move the one on this end. Yeah. Multiple on this end, actually. But, like, what would I want to move them to? There doesn't seem to be a switch or something here. Does there? Am I just, like,. Failing at perception again? Okay, that one needs a key, this one needs a swag. So where's the swag? I wonder if I can blow these up in the toy. Yes, I can. Does that help? It makes me feel a little better. Yeah. Oh, okay. So I was just being an idiot, but not in the way that I thought I was. What else is new? Okay, why did this room need a loading zone? Ah! Yeah, that would explain it. Okay, so this room is, like, huge. Just blow those up. Yeah. 
Not again. Hey, Link, if only you had a sword of some non conductive metal. Okay. I can't jump to that, right? I must be able to jump to that, else what was the point? Come on, man. You look different. Oh! You're a thunder case. This is new. Found in desert habitats, these winged monsters are attracted to dark places, such as caves. Their internal organs generate electricity for attacking prey. They often gather in colonies, are active at night, and sleep in the day. Those who come too close and awaken them often fall victim to attack. So yes, even the bats here are electrified! Still not as annoying as the ice version. Well, I'll take this. Okay. Okay, that's useful. I guess we could go back to that door that requires a key. And actually we might have to. Those hydras aren't back. <laughs> All right. What have we got here? What are you? A throw. So the song creature is cowardly by nature, it will expose an array of densely packed defensive spines when approached or provoked. Okay. So like that Oh, it's explosive, okay. So in that case, can I like bomb? Easy. But that's more scorpions, isn't it? Ugh. Okay, ladder's broken. We can climb this. No difference, really. I saw that statue there. Don't think I didn't. See what that is. It is time to time shift. Now, this place suddenly feels a lot more intimidating. Not helped by the fact that, you know, the turrets are working. Beamos. Ancient security mechanism. Its weak point is its eye. The eye is also a weapon that fires the focus energy. A 100% failure rate at any attempt to strike the eye with your sword while it is still on top of the pedestal. Okay, so use a weapon that can strike at high targets. Or lower its head to a height. Your sword can. As I do not have a weapon that can strike high targets, um, yeah. Okay. 
Okay, that wasn't good. Whoa, that goes fast. Out of here, turret. Can I not be pushed against the electric gate, please? Okay, but I saw a switch here, and that's probably important. Yeah, okay. Now, how the heck am I supposed to cross that? Yeah, because that's not going to work. Not where I wanted to start. Ooh. Okay, I'm going to need those stamina periods. Why the heck do these conveyors go so fast? Where is this junk coming from? Ugh. <sighs> There's another one of these? Oh great, turret two things, huh? Spin attack, spin attack, horizontal. There, huh. This opens that door. Okay, so now we've got two doors open, but which one do we go for? Ow! I guess the closer one wins. Shut up, fine, I know. You guys are explosive. Oh, yeah. And it's weird that the robots would run such a dangerous place, but then again, like... This is for robots, not humans. Go up and get this. The Gust Bellows! An ancient and mystical device capable of blowing an endless gust of wind. If you feel the controls are blah, blah, blah. So yeah, this is our turbo cleaner. It's basically just a leaf car. I guess a sand blur because we're in the desert. But yeah, it's useful. This thing even made it into Smash Brothers, actually. Also, yeah, surprisingly, we did not have to find a mid-boss for it. It's just... it's there. There's the item. I'm okay with this.
so yeah, this is totally what we can use to clean up that one. Yeah. Place. Thing. I'm not going back, am I? Not this way. So I guess whatever was behind that other door can wait until... Uh... Can wait until whenever I feel like it. Ah! Time shift stones for. I mean, clearly the things are useful. Were they mining it for, like, in case their civilization collapses due to mechanical induced climate change? So that they would have a way to revert back? Eh, that's as good as any explanation I'm gonna get, I think. Goodbye. Just get blown away. I like this thing. No! Okay, um, this wasn't the total boss. Most of the boss. Open. Show me the prize. Okay, this was the total loss. Oh, okay. So I don't have to walk all the way back, just part of the way. You know, did I not just kill you? Did I not just explode you? Okay. This is a shortcut back. I appreciate that. Especially when I do stupid things like that. Anyway, um... Yeah, okay, this isn't gonna help. Yeah, yeah. Really, it's way too dusty in here. So let's run the sand blower. Um, I'm guessing this goes back into the big room. It absolutely does. Okay. So that means I can now go to the other room. The past room. Yeah. Not dealing with you. I could probably clean the sand off the, 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 the off the block in here while I'm thinking about it. I'm not sure if there's any purpose to doing that, but I can do it. Oh hey, you guys dropped jelly. I do need a few more of those. Aha! Uh -huh. Way. Can I move this yet? No. Push, push, push. Yeah. 
there. But again, we're going this way first because there's a door I missed there. And I'm wondering if maybe it has the map or something else I would like. Oh great, there's another one of these. Uh, PC alert again, I don't care. I'm not even recording this on my PC. Wow, I somehow managed not to ram my face into the electric barrier. Way to go, Messi. I have to stop running to jump off? That makes no sense whatsoever. But fine, whatever. We'll play by your rules game, Al. I need horizontal. Poor stab. Ugh. At least, like, I know which of those I need ahead of time. I... I'm an idiot. I am such a fool. Ugh. Sweet. Let's do this. I think my rupee capacity has gone to 900 and yet. I have not let it get over 300 yet. Ow. Stab. This wasn't the door. It was a chest. I did all that for 20 rupees? Yeah, funny that I mentioned rupee capacity. But okay, guess are important too. All right, let's go through the other door. The whoa, it's more sand. Everyone loves sand. Out of here, out of here. Why do these platforms have, like, broken spikes on them? Was there something on top of this platform in the past? Am I going to need to shift this room to pass to activate it? I guess we'll find out. Uh, thank you for the heart. What? Excuse me. I'm busy. I'm trying not to die. I understand that you are doing that too, but you are getting in my way. Okay. Blast it. Time shift stone! Okay, why are there drones here now? Oh! Oh, I see. These things are like... that. You know, I remember 
remember seeing one of those pinwheels in Elton Volcano, but it wasn't connected to anything. I wonder if we'll need that or something. Horizontal! Horizontal! <laughs> there! See ya! No, seriously, what is that drought? Is that something I'm gonna have to be worried about? Yes, it is. Okay. Um, this is not good. Okay. Um, maybe shield bash? Yeah, okay. This is your pulse. Set Built in ancient times, is armed with missiles fired from a central turret and flying bombs fired from both of the sides. It also suggests you can repel the missiles with certain items at your disposal, such as your shield. Okay, so just keep doing what I'm doing. Got it. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Ugh. Okay. I hate this thing all the way. Oh, do I hate this thing. Goodbye. You know, it would be cool if, like, you had dropped any of those rupees where I could reach them. Just saying. Honestly, why would you use wind power in a place like this? Who knows? Mysteries upon mysteries. I hear enemy music, but I don't see the enemy. It's another one of those drones I'm ignoring. It. It's a turret. Horizontal! <laughs> Potion time! <sighs> All right. Oh, great. More Staldras, huh? No! Ugh. All right, why is my flailing not working on you? Here, one down. Always. Get out of here. Okay, so was there a purpose to that? I hope there was a purpose to that. And I did not just move this block halfway across the room for nothing. Okay, there was a purpose to that. I would like that.
That's what, the sixth chamber relic? Now I wonder... I might not be able to open the gate, but I can blow air through it, right? And that might reveal things. Things that we would need. I do not know if I can put the beetle through this. I cannot. Flingshot might do it, though. What is that? I don't know, but I feel like we might have to kill that. Yes, we will definitely have to kill it. The security and defense mechanism was developed long ago. It will attack anything that enters its security perimeter. According to my records, the sweet point is in its mouth, but it requires some specific measure to make it open its mouth, like twirling that thing on its head? Because I can do that. Perimeter. Then. Okay, okay. You are faster than you look. Ow. So you're like the Armos from Ocarina of Time in that you're a statue that moves purely by jumping around. But you are way more annoying to deal with. Destroyed. Okay, that got bow. Huh. I'm thinking next save point I see, I might call it. I mean, we got the item, we got the map. We're probably more than halfway through the dungeon by now. This place is big! What the heck? Okay, but we reconnect with the bird statue there, so yeah. Another one there, another one there. Why the heck are three bird statues in this one room? I don't know. I now see why this room requires a loading zone, because oh my gosh. Alright, let's see how we are on time. Oh, definitely. It's been like 40 minutes.